at a time when many hearts are being tested, their faith are being proven. You have sown a great seed, says the Lord, and you will reap for it. You have not received Kabasatai, the fullness of the fruit from the tree, say the Lord. But it will come in the time that you need it. That fruit I'm speaking about is your pouring of my spirit. Behold, say the Lord, you have fasted and you have prayed. I've heard your prayer. And I will move for those who have put their life before the altar of sacrifice. Say it, the Lord of hosts. You will see greater testimonies, signs, and wonders. But do not be ignorant of Satan to destroy, to divide. Be aware of him. Do not be confident in yourselves or arrogant, say the Lord. But wait on me, trust in me, listen to me. Seek me, be directed by me. And you will find peace and rest for your souls. And you will have great testimonies. And you will know me as your God, saith the Lord of hosts. And I will reveal myself and show it unto you with great signs and wonders, saith the Lord of hosts. Walk in my will, and I will open the windows of heaven and pour forth a blessing that you will not be able to contain. It will go through and through. It will go to your homes, to your children, to your jobs. It will be with you, say the Lord, to give favor and deliverance. Behold, not often I speak to you, say the Lord, as a body, say the Lord, because I seek to edify you as individuals. And then, when you are ready, I speak to you as a body, say the Lord of hosts. Because many times I speak and many don't look within themselves, they look at others. Look within yourself and within your heart. And I will show you great and mighty things that you know not of. Behold, the Lamb of God. Behold, say the Lord. Have respect for my presence, honor for my presence. Know that nothing is hid in my presence. Say the Lord. Be sincere and I will be merciful. Do not try me, say the Lord, because you will be ashamed when the truth is exposed of you. But be sincere before me, and I will be merciful and gracious towards you, and you will find favor in my sight. Behold the Lamb of God. Let your faith be stood tonight, for greater is yet to come. For those that believe on me, wait on me, and trust me, behold the Lamb of God. Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, I have spoken to the body tonight. We pray tonight upon all these prayer requests. Those that are seeking you for their marriage, for their family, their relatives, the sick in the hospital. Those that are going to battle, they can't tell anyone. But they have written up to you, Lord. Let there be such a move of God. Let demons cry out and flee. As they did 2,000 years ago. Let your power be seen as never before. Let there be testimonies upon testimonies, Lord. 
I pray that your anointing will work. And upon the oil that they have brought tonight, let the anointing be set upon the oil that they will cover their children, their home, their family. God, the breaking of the yoke, chains, and fetters, enchantments, the, the breaking of wizardry. Oh, God, destroy the powers of darkness. That your life will shine as never before. In the mighty name of Jesus. Everybody say, Amen. Amen. How many glad to be in the house of God tonight? Yeah. 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 Yeah.